I'm standing with Wendy Reed. She and her mayor, Nonstop Charisma, who is a daughter of Carrizo, won the 3D in the first go of our Pink Premier side pot here at Pink Buckle 2023. Wendy, you've got a lot of history with this mayor. She's one you bred and raised. What can you tell us about her? Um, she is out of my good mare, Kid Me Nonstop, that I rodeoed on for years, and I was really excited to have a cross between her and Carrizo. Yeah. What were you hoping he would add? You obviously loved that mare. You, you had a long career with her. What were you hoping he would bring to the equation? He gave her a little more size than her mama and, and a lot more speed, too, I feel like. Yeah. This mare actually is, this is her fraternity year, she's fraternity eligible, but you chose to enter the Premier Pink side pot. Can you tell us about your logic? Yes, she's only been running since March, so she's very green still, so I felt like I had a better chance in the, in the 40. Yeah. Well, I would say your decision making, your strategy paid off. We'd love to get to know you a little bit better. Tell us, how did you start barrel racing? Oh gosh, my parents, when I was a child, they rode Western Pleasure Horses and we would go to the horse show and they had barrel racing and I fell in love with that as a, as a child, so I've barrel raced my whole life. Who have been some of your biggest barrel racing influences and teachers? Oh gosh, um, there's so many. Um, when I, the, very, the first few years I went to some pro rodeos, I, had, um, I was a little starstruck um, when I would go to the rodeos and see some of the girls, Lindsay Sears and Kelly Kaminsky, and telling my age a little bit. <laughs> well, those are fantastic people to look up to. I bet they've become good friends too. We've really enjoyed asking our contestants this year about growth. We know that it takes a lot of time and a lot of sacrifice to make, uh, to get to these events and to have horses ready. How are you always working to grow both as a barrel racer and as a person? Oh gosh, it's just, it, I've grown up doing it, I just love it, I, I don't know anything else. Every, every time we have a weekend without a barrel race, I wonder what normal people do. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> My final question for you is, uh, with your years of experience, what's the best piece of barrel racing advice you could pass on, or that you've been given? Oh gosh, just to, to keep it simple, and, and just enjoy what you're doing, and, and the rest will come. Congratulations on this win. We wish you luck today. Okay. Thank you so much.